fight. Ready. This. All right, let us get to the early round action here. And a lot of people believe that Armand Sarukyan eventually will be a UFC champion. Had a main event with Mataj Gamrat. That did not go his way. But he's back on the horse. Still believes that he will be a force to be reckoned with in this division. And as far as this matchup is concerned, doesn't really see a whole lot of holes in his opponent's game. So we'll see how he chooses to attack. Poirier's cheek looks like it's cut. Yes, it is. Starting to bleed a little bit now. Throwing early. Oh, big left hook there. That knee, that knee hurt him. And look at him post on the opposite side to give himself the right distance to land his beautiful knees. And that underhook helping him control that side of his opponent. Nicely done. And he's back up. is fauceting from that cut with each strike landed, and he continues to effectively target that area. You know, we are talking about a guy with super high fight IQ. So when you give him that blood, that crimson red. Oh! Under three minutes now to go, and what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Cheek and the blood coming from it starting to cause the fighter some problems. The referee steps in and calls for the ringside doctor. It's painful, right? It might not seem as though it affects the vision, but it's very painful. Every time he gets hit on this thing, it opens up a little more, but you can still fight. Yeah, doctor not here to make friends. He has no choice but to stop the fight. We have blood on our notes. <laughs> Goes into the books as a TKO via doctor stoppage. Bruce Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen.